Hi there guys, welcome to today's Captain's Vlog. It's 10.50 on February 17th, 2018. So we've been unloading all the equipment from the storage unit. It's, it's empty now, so that'll get hauled away. And one of the last things to come out of the unit were those. Now these are substantial <laughs> cables. Uh, let me see if I can find some specs written on here. I can, but they're really hard to read. What do we got? Well, they're both the same size. So let's read this one. This one is uh, Carol Super V U Tron 535.3 MCM. So 535 MCM cable. So that's, that's substantial, and they're both the same size. And these, as you can see, are, watch this, very, very flexible. It's the same stuff we used here. And we're replacing this old, rigid, pain in the butt cable. That's, that's coming out of service today. What you got? Yeah, that's, that's what I was thinking. We'll grab a pair of those. We'll figure out which pair, but yeah, you're on the right track. I'm, I'm guessing we're gonna need the bigger ones. Yeah. And we're gonna pull a couple more pieces of that. Probably one other piece of that, unless we have another red and black. I know we've got reds. Yeah, we got reds for days. Yeah. Black, yeah. We got, well, we'll see what we got, but what I'm, what I'm thinking is with the ends and the insulation, We'll, we'll do the PVC tube like we had before because that, well that's rated 2 kilovolts but it's a metal box, I want the thimble. But we'll, the, we'll terminate, the end will have like that and it'll just be a boltment to go right onto those. Very similar to the original system, just with much larger, softer, happier cable. My only real concern in all this is we're dropping, because we're going with so much bigger cable, the inductance goes down we start to grenade capacitors. That's the only thing I'm worried about. Everything else should be fine. We've got some uh, some substantial you're in line your experience resistance ESR effect. Yeah. Yeah. Oh yeah, okay. But yeah, because we're reducing the resistance so much, I'm worried about angry bad things. I don't think This, well, we're going from like a 250 MCM up to a 530 MCM. The originals are just floating over one. So, yeah, I mean, those are going on display. So, the room is completely packed with crap. We have to move, we have to empty fully a third of the room to be able to do the video shoot today. So, it's, it's going to be a fun blog. Enjoyed the show. Yeah, we're live. Okay, normally if you're going to point a camera and be connected to live broadcasting stuff, you let me know before you turn the camera on. And you go like, you give me like a two, one. You got it. You just said point a camera. Some level of, but yeah, if there's. You can, you can hit me anytime you want, sir. Okay. Some things to know. You're broadcasting live which means it's not going to be edited by smart people who work really hard to make me not look like an idiot, which is pretty much my normal standard. If there's people pointing cameras at me and I'm wearing a microphone and stuff like that and we're on, you can shoot live anything you want. That's cool, I can live with that. But short of that, you've got to let me know before you actually go live. Just, it helps us to not get sued and have protesters up front and fire trucks Stuff. Oh, come on. Protesters only happen once. It was a bad day. Don't want to do that again. Because, wow. So, let me know when you're ready. Do it for real. Whenever for you real. are, I'm ready. For real. I am ready. You're ready. I am ready. You've right literally now. been live this whole time. There's a whole massive time. thing that has to happen. 
to go live. I have to find my motivation. Okay. Okay. Three. So, no, you need to hear. Line of sight. Okay, right here. here. You go. We got three, two, one. Two, go. one. <laughs> go. <laughs> <laughs> Your job loves you. Chris, how long do you think we're going to run here? Till we're done. That's going to be like three days. Bring a lunch. We need a lot more than a lunch. Uh, yes. I'll bring the Wheaties. Anybody touches my Adderall, I'm going to be very upset. Oh, that was your Adderall? We're here today. In the high voltage lab. Where darkness has descended upon the nation. The mission is to restore Project Thumper, which is the 144 megawatt impulse generator located behind it. Project Thumper has seen over a decade of continuous use and abuse in ridiculous situations that have involved everything from fruit to canned beverages to hot dogs at one point. Plasma screen TVs. Plasma screen TVs, mice, um, and a couple here at students over the years. So it's time once again to do a complete and total teardown. This will be its 11th, I think. I could be wrong on that. Check the block. But this thing has undergone like 11 major revisions. And today's major revision is on top of a complete teardown rebuild cleaning, it's getting new main power rails, which are going to be quite substantial. Project Thumper has pretty much since the beginning used 250 MCM copper cable for the main power rails. We're upgrading that to 500 MCM cable, which is about this big. That's a, a 500 MCM cable. And to give you an idea of scale, I have tiny little midget hands, and this cable is actually 17 inches in diameter. So, it also weighs like 30 pounds. But that's, uh, that's one of the main power rails. So we're cutting pieces off of these for using for jumpers and stuff, and the actual main bus rails are sitting back there on the floor. It's just a duplicate set of those cables. So that's going to be the, the crux of what we're doing, is the replacement of that. But to do that, we have to install new supports. So we have these, which are our high-tech system insulator solution. These will actually be mounting the rails. And it takes a lot of them. There's 16 of these or something back there. You can see the, the white T's on the back. And they all have custom little caps. <laughs> and you'll notice we have T's. We have caps all drilled out, ready to go. We've got the hardware to bolt it in. We've got everything we need. We've got the clamps and all that. What we don't have, and what nobody on the entire team has brought out here yet, is the secret magic ingredient, which is still missing. And I'm just waiting to see how long until somebody notices that. This is going to be kind of fun. So that's what we're doing today, and it's going to be a fun time. And it's all going to happen by surprise, because my producer doesn't understand that he has to let people know before he takes the entire system live. I'd also like to point out that my producer, who is that guy, Hi guys. has decided to shoot an entire live event here on an iPhone, which is not a real iPhone. It's a East German war surplus iPhone that we found behind a Radio Shack a few years ago, and ignore the fact that we have three separate entire live broadcast facilities, so we're shooting on an East German War Surplus iPhone instead of, I don't know, the giant camera right here on a pedestal. We're not using this. We're not using the big Sony 3CCD camera on the Australian pedestal. We're not using this with a giant telephoto lens. We're not, we're not using this. We're using an iPhone. Mm -hmm. I don't know why. It doesn't run Facebook ads. That's I, <laughs> you can feed that to Facebook, I'm pretty sure. You should, if you can't, you should figure out. We work at the Geek Group. We're smart. We can do this. Well, we can feed it to Facebook at like 360p. <laughs> Live from the bus line. <laughs> There's a giant control room with like 50 computers in it. You can figure it out. That's a good project for Ed and Funky. Just, just tell them, you want this streaming live to Facebook, they'll figure it out. They're smart guys. Even. Oh! <laughs> Alright All right, so guys, thanks for stopping by. Be looking for uh, some more updates.
All right, guys, we'll be back. some serious pimping in front of the blue.
No, I'm leaving it. It's, we're chasing it's, it. It's, it's like a little bit short of a five gallon bucket and uh, it's heavy. We're, we're keeping it.
High voltage work tends to be hard to support and they're going to get more secure. And then a big, awesome chunk of victory. And then flame, death, and despair, and two laps later. It's a matter of resources and time and funding.
get something I can use it so I don't That care. box can't be there! Yes, ma'am. I'm just ah. annoyed because... Do these go in there too? Yep. I seriously okay. don't remember having this problem. Fine, I'm not going to talk about it right now. Yes, ma'am. I don't think we're going to be filming anything else if you want to do it. Hey, hey, yours are now intermixing with mine. We need to keep them separate but equal. <sighs> At least that's what Mr. Kidwell taught me. And he gave me every Anne Moran book. Like that's a sterile environment. You can see what she knows now. 
Mm. You just gotta want to relax. If you take some of the good pills that Dr. Amy gives you, everything will be fine. And it'll all be clean. And I'll look like your kids. If you relax. You're not quite ready for that. Have you start, met Lily? I would start easy on you. Yeah, she wanted to stab people with knives. I don't know. What's wrong with that? You say that like it's a bad thing. Some people need stabbing. I have it. I want to stab people with knives. The issue is they know and not to. Sometimes it's okay. When the voices say they're okay to stab, you can stab them.
So that's where we are now. It's uh, 1754 and everybody has bailed because it's that time of year. No, no work is getting done. It's, it's Joey's wrapping up. He's hanging in there with me. But we're completely disassembled and there's a little bit of cleaning left that I might get done tomorrow, but probably on Monday morning. And then Monday we start putting it all together and that'll be cool. So that's what we got. You guys have fun. Thanks for watching. See you. So it's like 2220, <laughs> and I was 
working late, cleaning this up, trying to get all the schmutz, fuck, it came out easy, trying to get all the schmutz I could off of it, because nothing's going to happen until like Monday at noon when the video shoot starts, right? So I got all the time in the world until then, and there's going to be no crew here. So I was cleaning this, and I got to thinking, well, why don't, instead of fighting to clean it for hours, fight to sand it for hours? It's going to take me the same amount of time. Get it down to bare metal clean, so all the soot is gone, and then give it a fresh coat of paint, because I like painting stuff. I'm not going to give it stripes, I'm just going to paint it. But I'm going to paint it. What do you think, Sam? Sounds like a plan. Because I've got until Monday at noon. Paint will be dry by then. Don't go more than one ahead. Yeah. And you got to remember where the hole is. So I'm going to sand this area, and then I'm going to come do that one. Okay. You may find a good uh, option to mark them is to go get a center punch. Cover her up with a center punch. Put a punch mark next That's to That's a great time. idea. You'll, you'll notice it? 